today I am going to the doctors and I'm going to get these injections. They're kind of like, they're not Novocaine, they're not cortisone. I forget what they are, but they're supposed to help with pain for my headaches that I've been having because of my, uh, I believe it's from Lyme disease. And uh, I have like neck and shoulder pain. So, uh, sorry, I'm like squatting down because this camera is too uh, low. So anyways, uh, so I've had them before and they did help with the pain in my neck and um, going down like my shoulder, but it didn't help so much with the headaches. But I am going again and they're gonna redo the injections. I think it's like every six weeks I'm supposed to get it done. So I'm going to Boston, going to the hospital to get that done again. And hopefully they will let me uh, film in there so I can show you guys because I didn't even get to see it myself They my husband did and they like injected me in the temple like right here in the head Actually, this is your temple right here in the forehead and it like puffed up and I wanted to see it It was almost like John's like you're developing devil horns So I want to see if they'll let me film and if they do I will show it to you guys so I just had the injections in my head and they would not let us film it. So John took a picture and you can see kind of like right there. Um, he took a picture because it like swells up in my forehead and they did them in the top of my head and then in my neck and my shoulder. And he wiped off part of my eyebrows, right? So, yeah, sorry, I couldn't show you guys, but I do feel better. It does help a little bit, so that's good. And, yeah, now we're leaving the hospital. Um, so you can see right there, they injected me there and there. And then, like I said, on the back of my neck and down my shoulder. And then they, this time they did it at the top of my head. Oh my god, it's like numb. Like I tap on it, like I can't really feel it. When he stuck the needle in my head on one side, I, I was like, are you putting the needle in there? Because I don't feel anything at all. So, I don't know, they help a little bit, like I said, um, for the headaches. The neck pain, it helped quite a bit. I felt like, I, I thought it helped for that. So, yeah, cortisone and lidocaine, is that what he said? Yep. The cortisone and lidocaine uh, shots. If any of you wanted to know if you're suffering from the same type of thing that I have, um, I know some of you have said that, who have, had, who have had Lyme disease have said that they've had that type of a headache, where like, it's like a tightness, like a pressure, and like somebody's squeezing on your head. So I just called the closest Starbucks coffee shop there is to me, and I am going to go pick up that new crystal ball drink that they got going on. I don't know if you saw my other video that I did, but I bought that unicorn drink and it tasted like ass. So we're gonna see if this crystal ball drink also tastes like ass. Um, what flavors do you have in those cake pops? We have chocolate, cookie dough, and birthday, and the birthday one is just vanilla. Um, can I get a cookie dough one? Yeah. And then can I get that um, magic crystal ball drink or whatever it's called sure what size um what do you have for sizes we have our tall grande and a venti oh, Ooh, like small medium large um i'll get a small okay you want the whipped cream on it yeah whipped cream okay anything else no that's it okay it's gonna be 738 thank you thanks All right, so this is what it looks like. It's green. I gotta turn my car off, it's making a loud noise. It's green and it has some sort of sprinkles on top and whipped cream. I don't know what it is. I didn't really read what was inside of it. Um, so let's see. Let's predict the future. Let's read this crystal ball. The crystal ball says, New England weather will continue to suck. This crystal ball reads, when I get home, there'll probably be a dog shit on the floor. This crystal ball tells me this drink will probably taste like ass. Let's give it a try. 
Ooh. Weird. It tastes like nothing. <laughs> it has like a slight peach flavor, but besides that, it kind of tastes like nothing. Hmm. The whipped cream with the candy on top is good. It tastes like creamy, watered down peach. This drink, as I predicted, tastes like ass. No, I wouldn't say ass. Like, not pure ass, but like somewhat assy. Like a slight assy taste, <laughs> I would say. Let's try this cake pop. Um, I don't have my mounting thing for my, whatever, camera. So it's on the dash and like, I have to like scoot down like this to eat it. This looks yummy. So it's the weekend. And during the weekend I eat like crappy food. I just spilled some like all over me. I'm a slob. I don't know where it went. Um, it tastes okay. It tastes like a an old donut. This drink sucks. It's like totally not worth it. It's supposed to be all magical and mystical and yummy and it's just plain old nothing. Oh yeah. On the weekends, I ate junk. Because during the week, I ate healthy and low carb. Um, I guess it's like a spinoff of the keto diet. Isn't keto like low carb? I don't know. But it's I call it the low carb diet. I mean, on the weekend you can eat carbs, but I usually end up eating like bad carbs. Like instead of like a potato or rice or something, I eat like cookies and candy. I need to stop doing that. I told myself this weekend I wasn't going to. As I inhale a creamy drink and a cake pop. Um, so I will probably not eat any other junk. This weekend besides this. I might I might have like one cookie tomorrow, but that's it. I'm not gonna eat like shit. I went down my sleeve. Oh my god, there it is. There it is. I can't get it out. Are you fucking kidding me? It's like stuck in there. Alright, it's out. Um Yeah. So since I got those injections in my head, and it was a little bit painful, like burning, pinching feeling, I figured I'd treat myself to this thing, but I wouldn't get it. I think it came out like March 22nd or something. And they said they were only going to have it till the 26th. But when I called over there, they're like, we still have supplies, probably because nobody wanted it. It's gross. As I predicted, no good. So that's it, I guess. My life is boring this weekend, so it was just getting shot up in the head with needles and getting a sucky drink and reading my fortune. Till next time, stay magical, my friends. And I will talk to you guys later.